All right, guys, brand new merch drop just went live, cboystv.com. We got all the new stuff up on the wall behind me. I'm not going to spend too much time talking about it. If you're interested in it, go to cboystv.com, check it out. Per usual, we are giving away a fully built up custom CRF 110. Every $5 you spend gets you one entry, and it's a very short giveaway. We're running it from this Thursday the 17th through next Monday the 21st. If you guys don't buy anything from the drop, we just appreciate you watching. Let's get into the video. Like this whole bracket I'm taking off. Is it gonna have like stability in it? Dude, it's gonna have a toilet in me. <laughs> oh my god, no, I assume this isn't for any of us. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why does this guy get so many gifts? <laughs> This looks perfect. <laughs> yeah. This couldn't be any better. And it's sturdy too. Oh my gosh, Ken's gonna love this, you guys. He's gonna love it. So good, you almost cannot smile. <laughs> nice, this is not. <laughs> it's functional. <laughs> he likes it. Oh, oh, you got rid of the footrest, though. <laughs> this is fucking gross. <laughs> Do you like it? No. What? what? I don't like 99% of the things you give me. What's wrong with this, Ken? It's pretty nice. The dude. fact you're questioning why I don't like it makes me question your judgment. I like it. What's not to like about this, Ken? Well, it should have been leather. God damn it. All right, we're on a rescue mission today. Ryan was trying to come into work, got stuck leaving his driveway. So then he called Jake with his tracked raptor to come rescue him, because apparently that thing can't get stuck doing anything. Jake gets stuck. So now we got to bring in the big guns. We're coming in with Ken's Ford Bronco. Ken, if you pull this guys out, I'm going to give you the truck title. The Bronco hasn't failed yet. He's had to pull out Ryan's shitty little TRX twice now. So we'll see what happens. Luckily, if Ken gets stuck, we got another backup Bronco if we need it. <laughs> if this pulls out both of them, especially like Jake's Raptor be on tracks. Like, what does that even mean? You know, Ken, honestly, like, we've made fun of this thing so heavily, but it really hasn't failed ever, other than the one time it got stuck. That one might have been user error. I had traction control on, which is partially my fault. Well, and you were in like a six foot deep ditch. Ken currently has the most viral Bronco on the internet. I know for a fact. Yes. I never told you guys this, but I had people from Ford texting me about it. What? Yeah. <laughs> You didn't tell me this? There's this other girl that makes Ford Bronco videos and she wrapped her Ford Bronco the same color as Ken. She wrapped it? Yeah. That wasn't paint? No, she wrapped it, bro. It was like blue. Oh, that's pretty funny, actually. Yeah. <laughs> God, Amelia's is hot. We're putting that in. Maybe you guys could have, you know, okay, little I'm Ford Bronco babies together. <laughs> I was like awestruck when we were at uh, <laughs> Cletus's and I was like, Holy shit, Amelia is so much hotter in person. Did she outgrace you though, Ken? Oh yeah, she outraced me like 10 to 1. Well, maybe she could teach you how to drive too. Maybe. So Ryan basically lives on a peninsula with lake on each side, and it's like a 50-50 shot if he's gonna make it to work every time that there's a snowstorm. Holy shit, look at this drift. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy crap, boys. No, I this is not done. Jesus! <laughs> Break some mirror in the process. Okay, we okay. got spares. Holy frick! Yeah. I was gonna make funny, but honestly, this is a lot of snow. Dude, there's no way. Who got a chance, Ryan? Was making this, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Good get more of a run up, and if you get stuck, you got Big Ken right. now. I'll just pull you out. <laughs> I want to see him just hit this thing full speed. I don't think I'm going to make it. Holy crap, bro. 
Oh, did you let off? I couldn't see. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'm framed now. Ken's got to come rescue you. Yeah, yeah, Ken. Send him in. All right, Ken, get speed. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Stuck. You needed more speed, bro. Bro, what was that? You were going like two mile an hour. Yeah, he's stoked. I'm calling him back up here. Ken, you know Mike's not up yet. It's only 11. Yo, Ken, do you have an iPhone? Hey, it's Mike the Sandman. Can't. Mike's still sleeping, yeah. Who would you like to call? Mike the Sandman. Yes? Steven, we need your uh, your expertise out here. We're on Ryan's points. Um, Jacob is stuck. I am stuck. And Rhino is stuck. Oh my gosh. All right, Mike, hurry up. Let's go. I'm going. The car hasn't even started yet, so that's a bad, bad start. Now we wait. Mike's going to take a 15 minute shower, probably jerk off. The jerk off will take 15 minutes, and then the shower will take another 20. If it takes him 15 minutes to jerk off, good for him. That guy wants to really be laying pipe. <laughs> I forget, fuck. Oh. Dating Ryan's <laughs> little sister. Shit. CJ, you know we can't make those jokes <laughs> anymore. So Mike? This little guy's not gonna do anything. You gotta pull Ken out. <laughs> What's our plan of attack here? I don't know. I don't Go think home. Leave Jake. <laughs> well, we can give him a ride. Bro, I can't even see Jake over there right now, look. Let's go, Ken! Let's try it, I guess! Oh! What'd he just do? What'd he just do? You bet you did pull it in. Oh, fuck! No, Ken did. His bumper mounts bent it in. Yeah, I said, let's not do it that way, and you're like, no, let's find it! It bent him in. Bent what? These don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just can take it off. Ryan, you want to pull your? Let's pull out the T Rex. It's what? stuck. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't. Ken, that's why we're here. I feel like you might have bent your frame doing this, Ken. It's probably frame yeah. damage total. <laughs> salvage title. <laughs> salvage title. He got a salvage title on his Bronco <laughs> after towing you out. <laughs> Wait, is it bent? Yeah, they're bent. Uh, Are you sure? Yeah. You can look at it, CJ. It's as bent as your front lip is. <laughs> Did you see his front lip? Ken, my front lip was only like 1200 bucks. That's way Ken. less damage than you have. Ken. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you just <laughs> deflect? Oh, you're I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't think your front grill is in line now. Shut the fuck up, man. <laughs> Are you guys sure it's not too cold to be arguing? Everybody. All right, so we got Ryan out here plowing an ice track today so we can take the uh, razor out with some studded tires. Only problem is we kind of got a metric shitload of snow. Yeah, it's definitely a lot more work than last. But at least we got a skiddy this year. Yeah. All right, so Ryan, is just about done with the track. He's gonna make one more wider angle on it, or like wider turn. Uh, but I must say, he, he truly is a visionary. Or maybe he just looked at a lot of dicks in life, but I don't know. He did a great job on that, on that track. We got our old studded tires from the Maverick. We threw them on some Razor wheels, and we're gonna be putting them on our Polaris Razor. These tires are insane. They're so grippy, whatever you have it on is like almost tippy. They're not your traditional studs. They are snowmobile studs, so they almost work too well. And on top of that, we got little tiny studs on the outside, which like normal people would just use for their whole tire. All right, well that's that. The razor's ready to go. It looks mean. 
I think the official term for uh, tires like this is Rambo tires. That, that's just what I've heard from like. And it's pretty people. fitting. It's literally like a freaking chainsaw on each wheel. So, I don't know if it was in one of our videos, but Ken said that he was gonna take his Tesla out on the ice last year. He did say that. He did say that. He needs to do that. He's got to follow through. Keep, he still has it too. People keep commenting about it. Yeah. People remember. Yo, Ken. Do you remember, you got your Tesla and you said, I'm gonna take it out on ice. Or maybe you like hinted at it, you're like, Tesla out on thin ice? He, uh, he remembers it, he's shaking his I head. Do. Yeah? Yep. I don't actually. When did I say that? Please play Roll the clip. Roll the clip. You should bring your Tesla out there. Uh, I just got it, I'll, I'll pass till next right, winter. Right, next winter. Right. You said it, I'll pass till next winter. I'm gonna pass again. You take your GTR out if you really care about it that much. Can we get my GTR out there? I'll take it out on the ice. No, you can't get your GTR out there. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I, no, that's, that's my final answer is no. Yes. All right, since Ken didn't want to use his Tesla on the ice, we figured we would make something a little more comfortable for him. So we got the lazy boy and some water skis for the bottom of it. We're gonna pull him with this? I don't want to take responsibility for this one now that I'm thinking about it. Well, what do you mean? This was all your idea. <laughs> if he knows that, there's no way he's getting on this. As crusty as this is, this is incredibly comfortable. That is gonna be a major draw for Ken. <laughs> Oh yeah. Ken's gonna love this one. Definitely be comfy. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my. I'd say it's solid. Let's not break it before tomorrow. Yeah. Well boys, what did we just find out? Well, I'll just show you. Brakes don't clear. Even get these wheels on there if they don't fit. That's what I said. I was like, how could they be that good? They're literally that you know, close. We could just shave the wheels. Like think we do, we just take a grinding reel, cut this rim down, the rim's basically garbage, I'm and just get a smidgen more room. That's fine with me. I mean, I'm down. Okay, let's do it. Shave them down? Yeah, let's try it. All right, sounds good. <laughs> We may or may not have shaved like half an inch off of each brake caliper, but I think it's gonna work now. Moment of truth. Probably not the most traditional way to do it, but we're short on time and we made it work. It does, but it'll be fine. Still rubs. Just a smidgen. It's fine. So if you guys couldn't tell, Ryan truly is a visionary. I'm not sure where he comes up with this stuff, but amazing. <laughs> All right, the goal for today, not end up on my side or roof. I'm proud of you for setting good goals, Ben. Thank you, man. All right, you ready? Do I look ready? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Do I look ready at sorry. all? <laughs> Doors open, seatbelt <laughs> on, track had so much flow to it <laughs> apparently ryan the shaft seems a little short but mike you were doing pretty good i don't know if i'd have as much trust as you did Dude, all you need is this bar right here oh uh-oh well that was fast i don't think it likes all the drifting <laughs> it's the donuts that did it in the spin cycle with 
Rambo tires is pretty hard. Really right. bad news. Actually, the first belt that I've flown. Yeah, I mean, I think it just a lot of stuff, but this never it, belt. I think it was 100% due to the fact that you had the Rambo tires on it. So much traction. Yeah. Did you try turning it off and turning it back on? I actually have not. <laughs> Should we? Did you just turn that off? No. That's not good. Oh, we gotta keep it straight. Brian's either hurt or something's wrong. <laughs> I can't even see that far. How can you see that yeah. far, Ken? I thought you couldn't see. I have one good eye, okay. And I can see there's a little green blob laying on the ground behind this good steer. What's up? Uh, Ken got spooked and he's walking to the truck right now. Well, now he's just hopping in it. Did he see us? Yeah, he saw you guys. I don't know how he could see that far, quite frankly. You guys saying he's blind. <laughs> I, I couldn't see shit. I couldn't see him. I couldn't see shit, but he was like, what are they doing up there? I guess we could just oh, go shit. sit in the truck with them and then you guys come down the road. Oh yeah, go do that, go do yeah. that. Okay, bye. I'll get back. Oh, what is this? <laughs> what are you working on? It looks like a death trap. <laughs> well, so far nobody's died on it. So far. It's yeah. a lazy boy on skis, Ken. Once again, it looks like a death trap. But is it comfy? Hey. 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 You look good on it, Ken. Uh, you spooked him. <laughs> what did I say you look good? Ken, dude, we've gotten you so many gifts. You're always so ungrateful. I think the one gift I'm most ungrateful for is the one Ben gave me. That's why I had nothing to do with this one. All right, let's do this. Well, Ken, how do you like it? It's really cold. <laughs> Is it better than your Tesla? No. Okay. It seems like just about anything that could have broke today or gone wrong happened. Miraculously, it was the only thing that didn't break was that chair, which is what we had the least faith in. All right, thanks for making it to the end of the video. It's been a hot minute since we did a merch shop, so it's gonna go fast, check it out. All the sales that we get from our merch, we put right back in our videos. We don't take any of that money ourselves. We put it into the company, into the shop, into the, our videos, so thank you for supporting us. Thank you for watching the videos. Check out the merch. $5 spent gets you entered to win this bad boy. Thanks for watching.